Hi Pisces, welcome to my channel, Albino Moonchild Tarot. I am Becky and I wanted to announce that I am celebrating two years here on YouTube. So yay, thank you so much for your support and your comments, shares, subscribes, and likes. Awesome. Um, so to kick everything off for year number two here on YouTube, I am going to go ahead and post a chance to win video. The link to that video is in the description box below if you want to just go straight towards it all right so here we are second half july 2020 this is for pisces sun moon rising and welcome cross watchers okay so first card out hangs man all right pisces you came to your own reading so turn it around set it down all right we have aries up in the house but we also have the emperor okay okay very positive and then we have the will of fortune very positive okay that is uh that could be sagittarius right there all right so underneath the hangs man we have the king of wands so you could be dealing with a fire sign um aries leo sagittarius sun moon rising we have the strength card so lots of fire here could be a leo and then we have the two of wands awesome okay bottom of the deck and the overall energy is eight of pentacles so pisces we're thinking about work what are we working on are we putting in the effort are we putting in the energy as towards what it is that we want and what we desire okay so a lot of delays maybe some delays in action things you you want to do but you're needing to look at things in a different perspective you know the world is changing so we need to kind of adapt to what is going on around us taking that time to just like observe okay we're trying to figure out okay how do we move forward okay or we're trying to find some type of answers because there could have been some delays or some blockages here um i do see um Some of you guys may be dealing with control issues. Um, you may be the controlling one or there's somebody that's trying to control you, okay? Others of you, this is in regards to a father figure. You're trying to overcome something which has had you tied up in a sense. Um... I do see you definitely moving forward, all right? If this is resonating, you do move forward, and then we have progression. So from that new opportunity, from that new action, that time to take action in regards to something that you're working on, that you're working towards, right? A goal, maybe. Um, we're making progressions. So it's about in due time okay so basically let go of control issues if you're trying to control this outcome it is going to happen it just happens in its own time not your time right so in the meantime working on things that promote action for you could be working out um could be a new job um but something to i guess in a sense keep you occupied while we're in the these delays okay so here we go with two of the clarifying cards from the naked heart tarot spirit of swords okay so for some of you what's being blocked is communication communication between you and this person um if you could be um your father could be a father figure, father to your children, something like that. Um, a, a male role model or masculine energy, shall I say. Okay, so definitely being hung up in regards to that, overcoming some difficulties. But with Spirit of Swords here, this is the King of Swords, all right, this is about cutting things out that no longer serve. Telling, like speaking clearly, communicating clearly, okay. Okay, so by accident, I picked up two cards, but there is no such things as accidents, so we're going to read them both. All right, we have the Nine of Swords and the Seven of Swords. Okay. So, some of you could be feeling trapped and stuck in a situation where, like, you know, it is just kind of toxic, 
All right, and I say that because we have strength out here. In order to have the strength card, there must be something you're trying to overcome, okay? So if you're trying to overcome, you're worried about overcoming this. You're having nightmares, you may have anxiety, um, some sleep apnea or insomnia, something like that, all right? Because you, your, your head just keeps on. All right, and then we have Seven of Swords. So this is definitely stealing from you. Either you are mentally stealing from yourself or somebody is deceiving you, okay? They're a raccoon. They keep doing it and keep doing it and keep doing it. What I'm definitely seeing here is... Um, and then there's somebody in between this that's not doing anything. Sees it, but doesn't do anything or is just closed off. All right? So somebody, who the, this deceitful person or whatever this is, deceitful energy, is closed off. So in a sense, if it's like anything, it's like a form of denial is what I'm seeing here. Okay? Things don't happen by accidents or coincidences. All right, if we want to peep at the bottom of the deck, we have the movement of pentacles. Movement of pentacles, which is the knight of pentacles. All right, so it could be a Virgo, um, Taurus, or Capricorn. But what I'm also seeing here is things, things are moving slowly. It's like... It's kind of like the energy is moving slowly. Working towards this is going to be slow. There's going to be stagnation in, in regards to work. If this is in regards to work, you know, a job or whatever. Or in regards to whatever it is you're trying to work on, okay? There is going to be a stagnation. Um, there's going to be a lot of slowdowns, all right? And, and that's because we have planets. Two planets. Big planets in retrograde. All righty. So... Here we go with the angel answers. We have look for a sign, all right? So look for a sign. You'll be able to see it. Then we have unlikely, all right? So whatever you think it is, it's unlikely. Um, again, this could be for Crosswatcher or for Pisces. Um, it's unlikely. It, like I said, this is some type of denial, okay? This is some type of big denial is what I'm getting, all right? Within the next few months, so work, things working out or moving forward in regards to work or some type of communication, things are going to unfold in the next few months, okay? So that is what I have for you. I hope that this message helped, and I will see you guys next go around. Namaste.